Dear students, in this video, I am going to explain you about void function. Okay, first I have to open the file here. I am typing one program, def fnc print hello then after that this is the main part then fnc and here the fnc it is a void function now i will save this program Okay students, you save your programs in separate folder. Don't save in Python system folder. Like uh, whenever uh, I save the file at the time, it shows the system folder that is Python folder. So here you save with a separate name PROG19. No, I am giving the name is PROG20. Now you run this program. Okay, you see here the output is hello. Now again, I will tell you the use of none keyword. When I call this statement, uh, this function like in this way. Okay, first I have to save the content. Then I will run this program. Now you see here, hello, hello, none. Why it is giving such type of output? Because once I call this function here, again I am calling this function here. Okay, you remove this statement. Now you run this program. Now you see the output is hello, then none. Why it is giving hello? First, this function will be called means whenever you call a function inside another function at that time the inner function will be called first and then after that outer function called here inner function will be called first then means not called we write here inner function executes first then the outer function executes e c u t e s now which is inner function here f u n c is an inner function and print is an outer function. I think you got it about the purpose of void function. Means in void function we don't use return statement. Like uh, when we use the return statement here, return first I will save the changes done in this program then you call it. There is no effect of the return statement in the void function. Thank you for this video.